Hi, we're streaming again. And it's gonna be a fun one. Okay, we've gone into we've gone into we've gone into voice mode. I'll have to sign in to play online because I accidentally crashed. Oh, I don't even have to sign back in. I can just load it. <clears throat> I, I downloaded a new browser because I am not dealing with MV3 when it comes back. Um, so I need to get the stream, the Big Mama stream. I can actually unpin this, which is great. Um, so we go from here. Oh, I can activate a VPN. That's great. No, I didn't mean to go to my... God damn it. Go to channel. Hi, Mika. You want to come back up? I can there we go. Uh... Here we go. I get knocked down. I get back knocked down again. You're never going to knock me up. Wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> Uh, that was certainly, that was certainly a, a sentence of all time. A sentence of all time. Okay. Change back over to live chat. Here we go. Got to send a link out. Gonna, gonna send another link out. Gonna send another link out. Okay, we're done sending links out. We can start. What do we do now, guys? What do you mean? We can finally start playing the game. <laughs> uh, it was cold today. Like, really cold. Alright. Run Jellfish. New. Uh oh, I have enmity? Ah, shit. Fuck. Why did you spawn me here? Go, 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 go. <laughs> uh, fuck, I don't have flea. I don't have flea. Run! Go faster, damn you! Ah, fucking shit! Fucking shit! They have Vanish Guy! Mother of fucking god! Please let me in! Let me in! My god. Mara, thank God. So basically, to summarize uh, the past 30 minutes of me playing after, before I crashed because I downloaded Brave, um, I got back on the boat, and I did boat stuff. I didn't go on to the top deck because I read farther in the guide I was reading that I should really start doing more. Um, and it said, hey, dumbass. Don't go on top of the boat because you'll fucking die. And I'm like, oh, geez, that sounds like a good plan. I won't go on top of the ship and die. And in a level or two, I can use the Legion Subligar. Legionary Subligar, which is going to be awesome. Uh, Scale Greaves. We don't have anything. I'm going to have to get a new Chariot Band or something. Somehow. Hi Chris, how you doing? I am using a new browser because I'm not dealing with MV3. I refuse. I fucking refuse. Behold, Runtelfish in all his glory. Behold a man! Mara is a very busy town. I noticed a lot of people just queued up here. 
Eating pizza rolls, hot as fuck. Dude, fucking lucky I want fucking pizza rolls. I'm gonna go buy pizza rolls. I am having Coke and I am having water. Now, like, also added hot sauce? Dude, you are fucking living it up right now. That is a dream come true. Hot sauce and pizza rolls is fucking lit. Alright. Out we go. Hot sauce and pizza rolls. Are, what flavor are they? Is it triple meat or is it just pepperoni? Or is it just cheese? Because I love me some triple meat. <laughs> Love me some triple meat. That'll oh. hide. And fuck it, we'll bring Najee out. What's the problem with three tanks? It works in Final Fantasy XIV. Meat. Uh, is that your full message? Did it just say meat? Fair enough. There's a heart blocking my sight of your post. Give me one second. I'll just meet. Okay, there we go. Come on. There we go. Okay, there's a zoo. Honey, we bought a zoo. You've been eaten by a Gru. All right, let's party. Kill some shit. Uh-oh, we're missing the zoo. I hit the zoo. The zoo is hitting hard. Missed. I missed. We all missed. Die. Uh, we're gonna use some abilities now. Go berserk. Oh, Jesus. That is a strat, Chris. That is a strat. Hey, we got a beastman seal. He was concealing a treasure chest. I wonder what's in it. All right, let's test our luck. I should really buy some thieves tools. Just as locked. Attempt to unlock. Punch that one of the two digits is three. Seven, eight, or nine. Okay, so we're just gonna go straight and entering the combination. 37. We've narrowed it down. 38. So it's 39. Got it. It's a Kukiri, which I can sell, and an Ether, which I can also sell. Groovy. How many items we got? We got quite a few. We got three Beastman seals, silver name tag, some slops. That Kukiri we can sell for quite a bit. All right, let's kill that mugger. Time to die, bitch. Get an aid. Provoke works a lot less effectively in 11, I've noticed. Probably works better in um, actual groups instead of trust parties. 
And we're all missing. There we go. Bomb toss. Here we go. Oh, Jesus. Hop it in voice chat in a second. Okay, that sounds fun. All right. Um... Okay, we need to go that way. Ooh, what's this? Sylvester. Suffer and succotash. Holy shit. You took all the damage over there. Alright. Here we go! Let me at him! I want to cut him with my scythe! My scythe burns with hot passion and fury. They was good. Oh, Jesus. Dream flower. Oh, shit. We are all asleep. Let me at him. Okay, he's dead. Ooh, we leveled up. All right, I'm level 19, so one more level until we can use the subligar. What is in the chest? A potion of plus two. It was a temp chest. So we got a potion plus two and a potion of silent oil. Groovy. Jumping in. Uh, jump in. Vominos. We can lead the way. Kill the goblin tinker. Er, 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 er. Time to die. Time to die. Get over here. There we go. We are going to use Dark Harvest. There we go. He is dead. He was concealing a treasure chest. I am bound. A Daedalus wing, which I'm going to use to use raise my TP. And a flask of eye drops. Groovy. Ambusher. I do like that the goblins in um, 11 match the ones in 14. Or the ones in 14 match the ones in 11. Sight skill reaches level 35. Still on Dark Harvest, though. There we go. Killed him. Killed that beer. Oh. Turn around, go that way. Swiper no swiping, swiper no swiping. Aw man. No, do not log out. And I need to go that way. Oh, Goblin Gambler. Die. Jesus Christ. Oh, we've pissed off the damn Dommel. Heal, damn you. Let me hit him. We 
got a slice of Domo meat. We don't really need the giant femur, I don't think. Don't need the bat wings. Okay. And how far away am I from a level up? About 2,000 XP. <clears throat> Let's party. Let's see if I can move around this. Nope, probably not. I wish I could assign my map button to my PS4 center button. That'd be nice. Okay, here we go. Ooh, got a little notification. Mighty Rarb. Get over here. Get over here. I want to fight you. Jesus. Die. Die. Die, potato. Die, onion. The chest is locked. Open it. Second digit is odd. Second digit is one. First digit is five, six, or seven. Combination is greater than 47, but less than... Okay, it's 51. In which case, it's 71. Hi. Hey, Chris, how you doing? Uh, not that great. Oh, what happened? So, when I was at my game, I tried to load uh, Max, which is... The replacement of HBO Max, mm. and it told me that three people were already streaming on it, so it kicked me out. Uh huh. But, huh? That's weird. The only people that can access this account is my sister, my mom, and me. Uh huh. So I kicked everyone out of my account and mm. read the password. Suddenly, no one's on, and no one's asking me for the password change. Yeah. So that means someone hacked my account and probably split it up amongst a few other people to watch stuff on it. Oh, Jesus. And I have weird shows that I never have any intention of watching on my account now. I would put two-factor auth on that now. I already did. Like, so mega every, time. Every time a family member needs to sign in, I get a code and I have to send it to them. Good, 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 good. Holy shit! And my uh, thief for the Pathfinder game actually reverse pickpocketed a teammate. Why? What what good does that do them? Uh, he's broke, so I snuck a gold coin into his bag. Hmm. And then he saw that someone paid him, so he went around asking people who paid for his medicine services. Hmm. And then when he asked me, I said, no, I paid you to be a party member for a month. Hmm. <clears throat> so now, uh, once a month in-game, I pay him a single gold coin for him to stay in the group because he wasn't activating anything for us to really engage in conversation about what we're doing or joining the party. Uh -huh. So I made a reason for him to join the party. Okay, that's kind of nice. Well, the DM was getting stressed out with him constantly trying to ask us if we wanted to pay him for his services, which was healing, as long as we promised him our corpses when we die. 
Uh huh. That's a little fun. Because he's playing, he's playing a necromancer that does medicine. Uh huh. So instead, I gave him a gold coin because he's desperate need because he got Isakai here with no money to be a party member for a full month. Uh huh. And our DM finally got things moving when I finally came out and told him that I gave him the gold coin. Mmm. And uh, I actually learned something from another play, one of my players that wants to play a Fabula Ultima game about what to do with necromancy. Do you, say that again? Uh, one of my players for the Fabula Ultima game that's going to be starting up here soon uh, taught me something about necromancers that I didn't consider before. What was that? Mixing it with Rogue. That's interesting. Basically, uh, if they have any type of status effect, it adds that plus two to the damage for a sneak attack damage, mm. which I'm already basing things off of them having a status where I get bits out of it. Fair enough. That so I could... thought, why not add extra damage with any attack, as it doesn't say major melee, melee, with magic. If you want to add that to your character now, just do go ahead since you leveled up once. Uh, no, I'm keeping it at that so I can actually start playing off of and giving status effects. Okay. Which apparently Crisis also counts as a status effect. Mmm. I gotta read the book more just to make sure I know what we're doing. Okay. Because I, I went in woefully underprepared for our first session. Do I sound fine, by the way? Yeah, you sound healthy. No, I mean, like, good. Audio quality. Uh, yes, that last bit, you sounded a bit too close to the microphone. I am a little close to the microphone, to be fair. Legionary Subligar. Uh, right now, you sound kind of clear, though. Good, 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 good. I'm kind of leaning Maybe in towards back. the microphone. Maybe move back a bit slightly. Okay. So not as loud. Okay. I can just relax. Okay. It doesn't really matter, but I want to sound good. There you go. Sounds perfect right where it is. Okay. That Sylvester took a lot of damage. <laughs> Gotta kill that mighty Rarub. I have made a new friend now, by the way. Oh, good. Who's your new friend? All we talk about. Uh, his name is... Uh, Heath, like the candy bar. Yeah. And we mainly just talk about knives, guns, and VTubers. Fair enough. If that's what you do. Well, we started talking because we're into VTubers, and then he noticed my knife and started to go off on the history of the type of knife it is. And Was it a Karambit? That... Uh, no, he calls it the Belly Buster because it's a switch and it springs out. Ah, yeah. And, uh, he told me that they are fully legal, and I said, correction, if it opens up and it doesn't come off the track when you're opening it against something, it is considered illegal in New Hampshire. Mm. And then we went over the laws of that, and then we moved into uh, favorite gun types. He was yeah, he's now he's now a permanent installment of our Sunday game. Oh, nice! One of the two digits is three. Oh, sorry, I didn't know you were doing the your chest. Is odd. No, I just started it. First digit is odd, so it's probably three. Second digit is seven, eight, or nine, so it's thirty-seven, thirty-eight, or thirty-nine. Those I'm are just gonna good start. hints. 39. I got it. Nice. A pair of white mitts. I'll take it. I gotta empty some of my inventory. No, I don't. I can take what's left. And a beetle so, harness. Uh, a fun thing happened when I was on my way to my game. What happened? Is the 
gas station that I stop at to get sugar-free energy drinks on my way there, mm -hmm. their gas price <clears throat> is at three fifty-nine when you use their membership card that takes ten cents off. Yeah, and there's two employees talking about why they're asking, figure, trying to figure out why no one's coming to get gas from them. And I said, well, it could be your price, because everywhere else it's like $3. Yeah. And they're like, oh, well, we're not allowed to set the price. And I'm like, I know that, but whoever is in charge of setting your price is pretty stupid, because literally just down the road, the same gas store that you guys are is literally close to $3. And they're like, oh. And then as I'm driving home the opposite way that I normally take, uh... The gas station there that I also have a membership card is two dollars and eighty nine cents. Hot damn! And I'm like, holy shit! I need to start getting all this gas that I can while it's at this price. And the funny thing is, with their membership card, I finally earned an additional ten cents off again. Mm -hmm. So next time I go, it's going to be two dollars and seventy eight cents. Damn! Good job. I emptied my inventory real quick. I just got another... You fill your inventory fast. I haven't updated... Shut up. <laughs> Time to bag buy the bag update. I actually do have to. I also need to sell some gear. Did I tell you that I'm currently building that uh, person that talks like Goblin Slayer? Yes, you did. Okay. Did I tell you what it was so far? You did not. It's a Strix Monk. A Strix Monk? From the really? Elemental Plane of Fire. Fair enough. Do what you want. It was the only thing I could come up with so far. I'm thinking about changing the race. I don't know mm. about the class. I'm not sure about the class either. You know, you know, Goblin Slayer has a has an actual TTRPG, right? Yes, I do, but I don't want to build the actual Goblin Slayer. I just like the short ways that he talks. So, like, he doesn't talk much. He literally just says like one word sentences. Yeah. I just don't know what race and class that would work the best for. Human fighter. Yeah, but that's so basic. Human ranger. Because Goblin Slayer is a ranger. Ranger fighter a uh, archetype. Class. Yeah, he archetypes really ranger... Um, huh? The only thing he's missing is multi-class of magic. Uh, he can use uh, scrolls. Yeah, but I mean like the actual ones that do their own casting. Oh, their gotcha. F dub version of casting, but still casting. Yeah. I just got another chest. Hold on. I'm getting too many chests why... at once. Is there a reason why they don't do a full face reveal for him? Um, they do at one point, I think. Um, it's part of the mystery. Um, uh, the. Uh. Cowgirl knows what he looks like, and so does the um, cleric. At the end of season one, apparently everyone in the guild hall knows his face. Yeah. 78 or 79. First digits. So it's 79 or 69. Got the lock. Also, the, the part in Season 2 I'm at, uh, Demon Slayer, or Goblin Slayer, is getting real fucked up mentally. He's always fucked up mentally. What else is new? Yeah, but it's uh, the younger brother of that wizard from Season 1 that died. Yeah. And he's starting to realize if I let people die from goblins, it's basically making more of me and I don't want people to go through that. Yeah. Of course.
Does something happen to his friend that he lives with? No, not yet. But something is going to happen. Possibly. I wouldn't be surprised. I haven't read the novels. Oh, are they still making the manga as we speak? They're making the light novels and the manga. It's a light novel series before it's a manga. Okay. It's still in production, but I haven't read those yet. But my coworker does. I'll see if she knows anything tomorrow. Cause ah, it shit. seems like there's going to be a time where something happens to her, and he's just gonna full on lose it. Well, to be fair, um, her farm got invaded by goblins. Yes, I saw the one where he fought them off. Was that in season two? Uh, it's before the end of season one. Hmm. Which I think the farm is also where his old house used to be. Yeah, it is. Because she said the the place has meaning to him too. Yeah, he he lived at the farm. They were neighbors. Okay. Okay, I need to find a place to sell my shit. Or at least level up so I can get rid of some shit. I have a new also, harness. I'm not, I'm not a fan of the season 2 intro. Why? There's a clip that shows his sister being dragged away by a goblin into another room. I mean, fair enough. Which, I get that it happened and it has meaning, but I don't want to see it every episode. I wouldn't want to either, because I've got some issues. Yeah. Like, mentally, from experiences I've had. I wouldn't re recommend watching the anime, then. Or um, reading I've, the manga. I'm gonna read the... Apparently I have watched the anime. I'm gonna read the novels, but it's gonna be okay. hard. Because uh, the manga is a lot darker than the show goes. I wanna, I wanna play the TRPG, but a little less dark. Uh, All right. Is it free, or do you have to pay for it? What? The RPG. No, you have to pay for it. It's a book. You can buy it at Barnes and Noble, in the manga section. Or you could buy it on Amazon. Damn. Yeah. It's not a really super developed TRPG, but I want to play it but still. It's basically a the manga anime and everything did so good, we might as well try it. Yeah, pretty much. There's actually a lot of TT or TRPGs. Yeah, like Konosuba. Animes. Yeah, I'm, it actually says that people frequently buy this and that together. Yeah, super. Ah, god damn it, my fuck. Uh, if you want next month, I can probably buy the paperback or find the PDF somewhere. Don't worry about it. I'm not buying the fucking Kindle thing. I know, I know. I'm not gonna make you buy something for me, though. Well, I mean, at the some only, point, the I. The only thing I want is the um, Fabio Ultima High Fantasy Atlas and paperback. Uh, well. I need to at some point run a game with you guys, so I wasn't sure if Goblin Slayer would be a good idea to. I think like, Fa I would play like to play with. Fabula Ultima, like oh, actually play it, then. like actually actually you, play it. Uh, you whenever play. you feel like you want to take a break, I can always take over. Okay, I'll let you know. And I'll take you if you want. That. I can literally style it off of Shield Hero if you want. Uh. Uh, not so sure about not that. Not a fan of Shield Hero. I like it. It just goes very long, and it has some sketchy shit. Uh, no, it, it's basically you guys are just summoned to another world, and so it's an isekai, have, and you have transforming weapons like it, and you can put stuff into the gem to hold on to, but you don't do crafting through it. Hmm. And your weapon does transform based on the class that you need it for. Fair enough. I don't know, that would be interesting, but I'm not sure how I feel about it. I mean, it's always an option. Yeah. Who is this dude? Yvonne Twan. <laughs> Yvonne Twan. Uh, are you working Thursday? Yes. No, actually, no. Why? 
I was just wondering because it's Thanksgiving. I'm, I'm not doing anything, work. so I'm probably streaming. Okay. I just wasn't sure if you had to, like, open after for, like, no, 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 no. I actually don't have to do that. Uh, I only work one day this week. All right, here we are at the crystal. Are you getting holiday pay or no? No. Which sucks. Because uh, my Thanksgiving ends at like 2 p.m. If you want, we can chill and I'll just stream. Because Carissa is um going to her th family's Thanksgiving, but I'm not because it's being hosted differently. Okay. Uh, let me check something. How do I... Uh... And I'm, I'm not gonna lie. I'm gonna be blazed out of my fucking mind when I go to my family's house. Lol. If I can plan it correctly, I will come down from the high as we're walking out the front door to go home. That's hilarious. You're gonna be blitzed out of your fucking mind. Dude, I've been learning so much of how this stuff affects me, how long it takes, when I have to take it before it falls off. Which I actually saw the person that helped me get my weed card and works at the dispensary I go to today. Sadly, he didn't do too good in the RCQ, so, okay. Mm hmm Ooh, Nico Ortiz posted another video. Fun, fun. Oh, it's more errors, soft fails. Rip. It's not too exciting, but he still makes it funny. Hmm. Looking up something? Yeah, I'm trying to find out how to get to Windurst. Uh, uh, do you know where to mine iron on uh, 14? Is where to mine iron? Um, I don't remember specifically. Okay. I'll have to find it because I plan on doing a mine uh, grind for iron after my Warhammer game tomorrow. Fair enough. And then you can just look after... look up a uh, console games wiki iron FFX IV. Okay. I just use the console games wiki for that. Because uh, on Tuesday I plan on then grinding through the blacksmith to get to the other thing you need while just pumping out iron nails. I would appreciate that. We need 18 of iron? them. And all high, as high quality as possible. We can have a max of 18 as high quality as we can get them. A max of 18 nails. Yes. That's it? Yes. Okay. Uh, yeah, I can easily make quality ones now. It's just going to be a pain in the butt because I can't do quick synthesis for it. Mm. <clears throat> Is your control too low? Uh, no, it's that uh, I only produce like a third of the things I'm making as quality. Hmm. Hmm. I mean, to be honest, my control is higher than my craftsmanship right now, I think. Oh, do you want to hear the mistake Joey made? What? He said if I started... The whole entire reason I started streaming 11 is because he said, if you start streaming 11, I promise when the game goes $10 that I'll buy it and I'll play it with you for 30 days. <laughs> it's $10, isn't it? It's going to be $10 soon. <laughs> Black Friday sale? Yeah. I fucking oh, love Steam. It's gonna be so miserable. Yep. He should not have said that. He should not have said that, but he's gonna keep good on that promise. Oh, and you guys are gonna be streaming together, and I get to make fun of him. <laughs> or you could join us. Join us, Chris. No, it's it's bad enough. I'm playing 14. Join us, Chris. I'm not a Final Fantasy player. Join us. Okay, here's what we'll do. If you start playing cross out with me, I'll start nope, playing Nope, nope, too, too much to ask. Oh, oh, now it's too much to yep, ask? Yep, it's way too much to ask. I'm not fucking playing cross out. Dude, they I don't they like fixed... vehicle destruction. They claimed that they fixed the helicopter controls. Uh -huh, no, and they didn't, they did they? They slightly improved them. It's still garbage. Fucking rip. 
I did a barrel roll when I tried to turn. Do a barrel roll! And if anyone ever plans on actually using fucking helicopters for an actual staple, they need to play the current season and unlock it with money. Do a barrel roll! You will want the hummingbirds instead of the one propeller in the center. And I finally perfected my <coughs> Leviathan where I'm actually getting wins now. Mm. It's literally just a car armed to the teeth with weapons. So from there... Some of these maps look familiar. Uh, they look similar to um, some in... Like, uh, Gale's mouth looks very Taroki familiar to Canyon. 14. Taroki Canyon. So I yeah. took a wrong <laughs> turn. Pierogi. No, Tarogi. Oh, I heard pierogi. Pierogi. I want to have some pierogi. I'm gonna have some pierogi. Hold on. How do I get from... Pierogi and borscht. I have to look stuff up. Tarongi Canyon to Windurst. Huh. I have no idea what I'm doing. I need to... Let me go back to Windurst. Windurst Woods. Then... Saratoruba. Tarangi Canyon. So, current area. So, I need to go down, actually. All the way down. Okay. I went the wrong way. It's too long didn't read as I went the wrong way. It sucks. But, yeah. This game is fun, and I enjoy it. Um, but, Joey thinks I'm a masochist for playing it. It is very low quality. It is not low quality. Fuck you. Dude, I can see some of the textures on the things. This game was made in 2002. I know. That's the point. We've advanced so far since then. There's mods and stuff. You can make the game look better. Also, I'm getting sick of those VR commercials now. Uh huh. What? I've not seen these commercials because I have ad block. Uh, so they now have a walking system. Uh huh. Where you're on basically just a slip and slide. That sounds based. It's just a smooth surface in a bowl that you're strapped into, uh -huh. and it just shows the people running on it and turning around. And I'm like, if you lose your footing on that, you're dropping so fast, and you won't be able to protect yourself because you can't see past the goggles. Haha, <laughs> that's funny. People are going to die from that. That's hilarious. And some of the commercials are claiming they haven't made it yet. It's just for pre-order. So and I'm like, so you have a commercial showing someone how to use it, but it's not made yet. Welcome to tech. Yes, selling something by demonstrating on it that's not made yet. I keep wanting to scream Bethesda every time I see that shit. 
Bethesda, damn you! Like, hey, you excited about the next Elder Scrolls? Here's a clip of going over a bunch of trees that'll explain everything. Except it won't explain jack shit. Funny thing is, we don't start production for two more months. Two months? That's hilarious. That's very generous, Chris. I still think it's funny that Microsoft handed them back the Elder Scrolls game and said, no, do it again. We're going to watch you this time. Do it again. This Todd is How why they shouldn't have <clears throat> celebrated being bought out by Microsoft. Because Microsoft is going to make sure they make a good game for once. No more Starfield disasters. And no more putting stuff out before it's finished and then telling the rest of the story as a DLC. Oh my god. In horse armor. Dear god, horse armor. Spend 20 bucks to give armor to your horse. By the that way, that will do nothing. Still, your horse will still die, and the armor cannot come off once it's on. Oh, Oblivion, you are my favorite. Did you hear about a glitch when they first integrated horse armor? No, what was it? When you get onto it, there's a chance the horse will shoot up into the air and then fall to its death. That's hilarious. Sometimes that happened when you climbed onto the horse. That's amazing. I love it. Oblivion was the best game ever. Other than Dragon Quest VII. I could do without some of the DLCs and... I will die by Dragon Quest VII. I will die on this hill. I I sadly couldn't get into Dragon Quest. I love Dragon Quest. It's so fucking good. I was recommended it because I liked Oblivion, and when I played it, I accidentally bought three games instead of just the current one. You bought and three games? I, I Supposedly, it was like three games of different Dragon Quests, but I don't think they were. I think the guy was just ripping me off because I was a naive kid at the time. What one did you and buy? I don't remember. It was three consecutive ones, including the current one. Was it three discs? Uh, it was three different cases. Three different cases. So, uh, for what system? I want to say it was for PlayStation. Well, the only ones that were on PlayStation was 7, which was a uh, three-disc game. Oh, no. It, it was Xbox. Oh, it was Xbox. I had, I had Xbox at the time. Oh, okay. And We're I, entering Aropago Pass. I started with the older one, thinking that it would be better to know story stuff. Mm. I had no fun in it, so I switched to the next one. And it was even more boring, and then I played the newest one, and I'm like, I don't understand any of this. Dragon Quest and doesn't return them all. Fuck you. I, I just didn't enjoy it. I think it's because I didn't know anything <clears throat> that was going on. Do yourself a favor, if you ever get a 3DS, hack it and download Dragon Quest VII from a legal source. Fun fact, there's a totally company legal here software in, legal. There's a company here in New Hampshire that jailbreaks 3DSs. We will not talk about that here because, you know, that's against YouTube's terms of service. Don't ha don't yes. pirate games, people. Do not pirate games, everyone buy emulators don't you don't buy an emulator <laughs> unless you're an idiot if you, don't, if you don't understand how to set it up buy so but pay someone to set it up for you dude it's idiot proof clearly i'm a bigger idiot than the proof oh my god chris i will set up a ps2 emulator for you i don't want a ps2 emulator it's amazing ps2 games are amazing what I want is a charging cord for the uh, Game Boy Advance SP that I have. I'll send you one. I have one. No, I'm going to buy my own. I have one that's not being used. I don't care. Dude, you sent me a Digimon watch. I will send it to you. I technically sent you two. You did send me two. I will send you my fucking cable. It won't By the way, do you want any dim cards for that? Yes, I do. A lot of them. Uh, I know that the site I originally bought it off of has some cheap ones. They're not that well-known Digimon, though. I like any Digimon. But I, I just need an excuse to, to use it because I need to get back into active shape. 
I thought about sending you a early Yule gift, basically. Oh, okay. That sounds fun. Because I, I don't like Christmas. I don't care if you celebrate it. I call it the I celebrate Yule. Yule. I celebrate Christmas because of Chris and her family and my family. Well, the Yule isn't really about giving gifts. It's about spending time together. And I know, but we got to spend the time, time together any way we can, like now. <laughs> you watch yeah, me suffer. I'll, I'll just find uh, some type of bundle for dim cards and just have them mailed to you. Sounds good. I want a Gamma Mon one if you can get it for cheap. Uh, you only have the one that came I have today. Pulse Mon. I also yeah. need to charge my watch because I haven't worn it in a bit. I didn't have a good cable for it. Winter's not the best time for doing exercise outside anyway. That is true. So I will probably leave it off for a bit until I get another dim card. Uh, which one are you looking for? Uh, Gamma Mon. He's a cutie. Although I will take literally any any dim card, just anything interesting. Oh, it's a little white guy. He's actually very cheap, surprisingly. Oh, cool. Look, look, Chris, we're in Winders. Oh my God, they have one of the butterfly Digimon that I like so much. Oh, based. It, they actually have a grouping of the fire guy, the polar bear guy, and the butterfly for sixty. That sounds lit. Oh god, it's all six. I didn't know there was a second page. Yeah, it's the full set from that series of Digimon. Jesus. Because you then have the uh, Black Lion one, the Beetle one, and the... I keep wanting to say Garurumon, but it's not Garurumon. It's Garurumon. No, the uh, guy with wolf armor. Metal Guru Ramon. Uh, let me see if I can save that. Send it to me. Uh, Show me. Yeah, I'm going to send it to you over Discord. I'll send it through the DM so I don't bug anyone. Oops. I forgot it doesn't work that way on the computer. Metal Guru Ramon. It's uh, the top blue the top one on the uh, image oh my god every time i do this there we go that oh wargururumon uh, is that his i believe that's wargururumon i might be no, wrong cause it's uh the season where they evolve themselves oh you're right i don't know what that one's called i keep wanting to call him gururumon because guru Ruvramon actually kind of looked like that. Yeah. But uh, sure. I believe that is the boy with the bandana. Mm. If you also want to pack in a screen protector with that thing you're sending me, feel free. I need one. Because those screens scratch so easily. Do they make screen protectors? Yes, work? they do. They sell them on Amazon. The app changed though, by the way, so it sucks now. But I will still use it for fun. And because I like racing Digimon. Uh, you might need the updated Vita bracelet for that now though. Oh, damn. Because I do know they came out with a version two. I know it worked on the, I know, I know it worked on the one I have. Supposedly the function of the Vita bracelet hasn't changed, but some of the technology that goes into it has changed. Weird. Which by the way, they also have a com a Kami Rider Kamen Rider. Uh, yeah, I know, Kamen Rider. Yeah, that one. I was watching Kamen Rider the other week. The one of the new ones. It's actually really good. Uh, do you know that the Digimon card game has a bundle coming out that's also on the website I use? Oh, based. Which? What's the bundle? Uh, I'm going to send the link to you in the Discord. Oh, it's P-Bandai. God damn. I can't explain it, and it's 80 bucks, and it looks like it comes with the adult cast of Season 2. Oh, yeah, because there's a new movie. Yeah, 
it's a bundle of all of them. That's awesome. Yeah, P Bandai are oh, the so P Bandai is the really expensive shit. Who the fuck is that though? Lu Owada. Lui Owada. I gotta. Watch they use the Japanese video. names. I really want the Digivices they came out with. Which ones? Uh, they're $130, but they have the uh, slidable cards for... What was the one where he draws his own Digimon it comes to That's life? Tamers. That's a... Yeah. One of they the best have, Digimon uh... series in, in all of Digimon. Uh, they've had pre-orders for a while, and now they're just selling the Super Complete Selection and anim Animation D-Arc version uh, Digivices with scannable cards. I would kill for one of those. 130 bucks. Jesus. Well, they're charging a premium. Just as always. Oh my god. I wonder if Amazon has stuff that's cheaper. Maybe. I have a Digivice D2. It's not the one I gave you? Yeah. I use yeah. it still. I'm just glad it still works. Yeah. I had to get a special battery for it. It was originally in my uh, junk box. Mm. I need to start walking with it again. I might start wearing it again at work. You can always just do the cheat of shaking it. I know. You know that doesn't yeah, feel right. Some of these dim cards are cheap. Yeah. Was Lilamon the one you were referring to when you said the D Butterfly Digimon? Uh... I think so? She wears lingerie. Uh, I don't remember. Holy shit! What? So, do you know that grouping of six I showed you that's worth 60 on that site? Yeah. Amazon. Three of them. 98.90. Not bad. It's more expensive than getting the six of them on that site. Jesus. P Bandai is where they put all the Gundam stuff now because they refuse to sell the good shit now in stores. Yeah. It's uh, annoying. There are some stores that get it at retail price still, though. I, I need to find a model shop in town that sells Gunpla. Although that I do have projects hard. of the ass still. Uh, the only way that I can find Gunpla in real life is going to an actual Gunpla store. Like a model shop? No, an actual official we've been approved by Gunpla to sell their shit. Store. Oh, Jesus. I, I need, think it's I being really wish treated I like the. Here. I think it's being treated like Pokemon is doing now, where you need to be an official store if you want to sell it. No, I'm pretty sure that I could find a model shop in Indy that sells them, and Hobby Lobby sells them too, but I don't want to give them my money. I'm not allowed in Hobby Lobby. I know, I know you're not. I don't want to support them either, really. But I'm not going to drag politics into this stream. We're here at Windurst. Oh, Finally. God. Now time those, to get scammed out of all my money by back cat girls. Just remember, cat girls may become a real thing in the real world. Who knows? Because Japan is working on it. They've been saying that for 20 we're, years. We're still not sure if they're turning people into them or if they're just cloning them from DNA though. Genetic abominations made by the horrors of mankind don't mind if I do. But it has been said that it is getting funding from the government now. 
simply fun. because they're hoping it will increase men wanting to have children. Have a Japanese baby. I'm not gonna lie, if they offered me to move to Japan, I happily would. I know you would, Chris. I am aware. Hey, the internet's faster, things are cheaper there. What's not to love? My internet's pretty good now, here. Now, if they said that it's mandatory that you have children, I'd probably have to second guess going there. Mm -hmm. Mood, mood, mood. So let's see, where am I going? To bed. Huh? You're going to bed. No, I'm not. Don't you have to get up early in the morning? I mean, decently. But I'm not going to bed just yet. I should technically be building my uh, poor hammer army right now for tomorrow. Rip. But I don't, I don't want to. Then don't. I hate that I'm the only person available to do fill-in games. RIP. And the only reason I can do the fill-in games is because even though I dropped from the league, I still paid to enter the league. Fucking sucks, dude. And I've been telling everyone that I've been filling in games for. At this point, I might as well have not dropped because I'm playing all the other games that I didn't want to play. Yikes. Yeah, tomorrow I have a 2,000 point army game. Why are you going then? Because I want the league to be over so I can stop filling in for other people. Then just don't go. Just don't go. But if I don't, they're gonna constantly be rescheduling a game that I don't want to go to to play with them. Just don't go. Also, I have nothing else to do for tomorrow, really. You could, you could go home and watch me stream after work. What do I do between that and then? You could paint your Warhammer minis. I'm not painting my Warhammer minis. But you should. I, I have I have too many paint schemes to get into one army now. Rip. Simply because I don't want to change my paint scheme, but oh, I don't want to... Scene. Sorry, continue. But I don't want to repaint the minis that someone else painted because I like how they painted it too. Mm-hmm. And then I have unpainted minis from him, unpainted minis from me, and I'm like, I don't know what to color what anymore. Mm. And I'm bad at decision making, so I'm stuck between literally a rock and a hard place. Bruh, that sucks. Oh, these are the 11 versions of the tiny people I want to pick up and walk away with. Don't say that. That is very sus. I'm sorry, but they're so adorable. The Lalafell are evil in 11 and 14. Wait, the short people are evil in 14? Yeah, very. Why are we You'll find out. Them, then? You'll find out. Are all of them evil? Not all of them, but a good por any of them from Ulda are pretty much hands and knees down evil. Uh. But the Taru Taru in this game aren't really evil per se, they're just annoying. They haven't rallied yet. 
They're good at magic. I'm starting a quest now. This is Shantoto. She's a powerful mage. I don't see her yet. Oh, oh blonde girl. Also, the Taru Taru and Eleven are really fucking annoying. Because they have cutesy speak. All of them. Did they actually voice out the cutscenes in this? No, they did not. Okay. That wasn't the point. There's too much dialogue. They could not possibly do that. I kind of wish they had more actual voice actors in the games. Yeah, but there's way too much fucking dialogue for that in both games. I know, but still, it's like I have difficulty re reading with everything that I have. I know. I really I don't know. want to read what people are saying. I know. I mean, no read well. You know read if well. This were, if this were D&D, &D, I would be an orc. Yes, I know. Why well, read when I can punch? Yeah. Sometime later... I wish I had oh. more fancy rice. So, uh, since we talked about me starting a Fabula Ultima game for the group, you just go ahead and start planning your character before everyone else. True. Which, there are some fun combinations I want to do at some point. I will start coming up with something. Mori Calliope is streaming, oh boy. She's streaming Minecraft. That's not creepy at all. It is. Everything Shantoto talks is rhyming. And welcome to the quest of Shantoto Ascension, the legend tour in her empire born. Do they Final control Fantasy. their shadows? I don't know. I have no idea. Well, did you see at the beginning of the cutscene their shadows move to the opposite side of them? I think that might just be the game being weird. Oh, okay. So, this is main story quest? No. No? Not even close. Oh, my group is talking about something. Okay. One second. Okay. Uh, they're not voice chatting, it's just messaging. Okay. Oh, they're just answering what I asked them earlier. Uh, Sounds good. Crystal. I need the crystal. So is Carissa leaving on Thanksgiving to go visit her family? Yes, in Indianapolis, okay. so an hour away. Okay. But we're having our private Thanksgiving on um, Tuesday. Okay. Just me and her. Uh, this Tuesday? This Tuesday. Okay, I'll, I'll try to remember not to bug you. It's all good, we're just doing a little thing at, at, in, at campus and then coming home. Yeah, but I don't want to interrupt anything. It's all good. She's so gonna I'll be busy. Wait. I'll just wait for you to message me on Tuesday. Okay, whatever you feel like doing. Behold, Runjulfish in all his glory. Did I level up? I don't think I have... No, Legion Scythe is still fine. So glad that okay. Bone Mask. I need to level up once more. Continuing walking. I need to go get that crystal. So, were you able to type in your own name, or did it randomly generate? I randomly generated it because I thought it'd be funny. 
Ah, oh, okay. But you can type in your own name, just good luck in a 20-year-old game getting your own. Well, I ask because there are games where you have to only hit random or select I a given I prefer hitting random. Actually. I much prefer hitting random and getting a randomly generated name. Like, Runtjelfish was perfect. Okay. You know what I mean? I'm not gonna lie, when I first saw it, I thought it said Rent Jelly ish. Rent Jelly ish. The F, the F turned into a Y. It's fine. So now I'm surprised we're it didn't change more. Huh? I'm surprised it didn't change more with dyslexia. Yeah. Welcome. Shintoto, hi. Oh, that reminds me. Also, when I was in the gas station today, I was looking at the energy drinks they had available, uh -huh. and I don't know what the hell happened, but everything that I was seeing turned into a foreign language to me. It did what now? Everything in English that I was looking at in the store turned into a foreign language to me. Weird. Okay, I need to go to the north. I need a pinch of bomb ash and two bone chips. So I'm gonna head back to the auction house. I'm gonna help Shantoto. So apparently the real Shantoto is fine. But there's another Shantoto named Domina Shantoto. I'm so confused. I'm gonna check my quests real quick. to get rid of some shit in my inventory. Okay. Greetings, I need to find materials. Bone chip, bone chip, looking for the bone chip, bone bone chip. 3,000 gil, Jesus Christ. I do not have the gil for this. Guess I'm gonna have to go b gather it myself. I just post something on the wanted board for if people need stuff while I'm grinding tomorrow and Tuesday. Sounds good. Because if I can grind my blacksmith up to 43, I can then make that other thing that you needed for the blimp. Perfect. It's an airship, not a blimp. I'm going to call it a blimp. Please don't. I like... I like saying blimp more than airship, though. I've had too many experiences with people on the internet to accept blimp as a word. Can I say Fire Nation airship, then? Not a Fire Nation one. Oh, come on. Why? That's way too wordy. Start the Fire Nation <gasps> attacked. It's way too wordy. can't wait for the next uh, Avatar series to come out. Why? Uh, the next one is supposed to be them older but before Korra is born. I don't know uh, if it's going to be any good though. 
after that, we're going to meet an earthbending avatar, which we don't fully know, as I'm aware so far, if it's going to take place after Korra or before Aang. Who knows? I think they should just move on. They still have a big fan base, though. They can still pump. No, I mean they should. They, they should move on from Korra and Aang. Well, they want to have uh, the between Aang being a child and Aang being an adult, because people want to know what happened between. And uh, then they're going to basically move on to other avatars at that point. They should definitely move on to other avatars. I'm sick and fucking tired of them being stuck in but the past. They currently have three different series planned with the adults uh, Aang group and then the earthbending avatar and then they leaked nothing for this third series. Mm. Which... Apparently, they're also getting a live-action series like how One Piece did. Mm. Where they're cutting out all the filler and just making the series. Which is a mistake. I don't know, people seem to like the uh, One Piece live-action more than the anime. That is untrue. Not more I than mean, the, the anime. Die the die-hard fans still love the anime more. That's all at 25. I'm wondering what they're going to do with Digimon next. I think a series following up on Tamers would be interesting. I kind of want to see the two worlds merge together for some apocalyptic event. Did you not watch Try? No, because for some reason there are bits and pieces scattered uh, against all other streaming services I have. Weird. And they're not good at listing which one comes first. Try. Just the first yes, episode but of there's, Try. There's Try, then there's Try Something, and then Try Something Else. Like, I have not seen Try the series. I've been seeing Try movies. Fair enough. They, they are all in movies. Yes, but each one has, like, a different name. Yes.
need to look up what this item does. Okay. Uh, Excalibur. If it's anything like most weapons or most games, it's going to be an overpowered weapon. No, it's a joke weapon. Okay. Now, is it a joke weapon like in Cyberpunk 2077 where it's actually all powerful even though it's a joke? No. It is just useless. Okay. Is it one of the useless weapons that comes in handy in a certain encounter? Or just period useless? Period useless, but it's fun to have. Okay. Like, might as well. somewhere else. Here we are. So we need to go shopping. To that building over there. Maybe they will have the things I require to move forward. Is there sometimes a yellow marker when you open up your map? No idea. A random glitch? Uh, don't remember. I have no idea what you're talking about, actually. Oh, when you opened up your map last time, I saw a yellow marker below you. No idea. There we go, now we're making back some gill. When you open your map again, if I see it, I'll take a screenshot. Okay. Let me open my map real quick and we'll see. What do you see? Where is it? Uh, hang on, gotta do some catch up here. Uh, I forgot how big the uh, time skip is. Oh, there it is. Uh, it's right underneath port. I don't know what that oh, is actually. Now it's yellow and green. I have no idea what that is. Okay, at least I know I'm not going crazy. 
Maybe it's a merchant of some type? Maybe. Yeah, I, I just saw it every now and then when you open up your map, and I wanted to make sure I'm not going crazy. Gotcha. Talk to someone for a cutscene. Or open. I need to eat something soon. We'll get something now. But the cutscene won't continue unless I hit the buttons. Oh. Uh, I don't understand how it's a cutscene then. Perhaps it is a cutscene. This is a horrible story. Hmm. I wasn't paying attention. Basically a group of mobs joined together to go find the land of their dreams and failed. And now they're just forever wandering, looking for a city that will never be found. Rough. Wow, so he's reading a story to a bunch of children that results in failure. So what's the moral of the story? I don't know. I don't think there is one which doesn't make it a good story. Yeah. He wrote the story himself. No. He did not. Oh. <laughs> He's fried to a crisp. 
Yeah. Wow, that guy's a horrible storyteller. Yeah, a little bit. I don't think he picked the right stories to tell. Probably not. All right. We're gonna we're gonna chill for a minute while I go make some ramen. What kind? Uh, just some regular ramen. Don't forget to add the hot sauce. I can't add spicy stuff right now. Why not? Because my stomach has not been easy with spicy. Oh. My stomach's been craving it like it's the only food around. Yeah. So I'll be right back. I'm gonna make ramen real quick. After these messages. Okay. It is in the microwave. Oh, you have ramen cups? No, I'm. I have a microwave bowl bowl thingy. Oh, okay. I just prefer to use that. If I had the cups, I would just use my water boiler. Uh, also, grab some muffins more, from this morning. I need to get more ramen bowls and cups. I don't like making it on the stove. I don't either, which is why I make a, make it in um, stuff. Microwaves. I'm eating some muffins. Oh, what kind? Uh, pumpkin. Ew. Fuck you. I'm so sick of pumpkin. I get it, but Carissa makes pumpkin muffins sometimes, and I'm having fun with it. Yes, but when I say I'm sick of pumpkin, is it disgusts me now whenever I taste pumpkin. Mmm. So I'm really upset at an ice cream place here. Why? They make pumpkin ice cream. Okay. They also insist that you have not lived until you drink a pumpkin milkshake. 
weird. I can do without the pumpkin ice cream, and I can sure as hell live without the pumpkin milkshake. Now, if you want to make a chocolate cake shake with actual slice of chocolate cake, then I will be interested. Fair enough. All right, I gotta I gotta go grab my melon. Okay. Second, Chris, I have my headphones off. Okay, I'm back. I bet you totally didn't say anything terrible about me. I honestly haven't really been talking. Oh, okay. Fair enough. Okay. What? Uh, I'm watching this Facebook video that says never let them know your next move. This guy pulls out one of those collapsible lightsabers and starts doing twirls and twists with it. Jesus. And the guy in front of him then does this weird little wiggle dance as he's getting closer to him. And then just backhands him in the balls and starts dancing again. Weird. Add a little bit of cayenne and some other spices. I've learned cayenne doesn't do too much if you add it to liquid. Mm, fair. It's just enough for a little bit. Just that kick that you need. Yeah. I've learned that baking with red pepper flakes don't work. Because you can never tell what's a seed and what's not a seed. Well, I 
gotta get off, put the armor together, and go to bed. Okay, get some sleep. Okay. See you later, Jack. See ya. Good night. Have fun with your stream. I will. some ramen real quick. Alright. I'm a warrior. What are we gonna do? Oh. Hi. You good? Okay.
All right, we're gonna end the stream here, guys, with the uh, with the quest being delivered. All right, there we go. So that's it for tonight, guys. You guys have a great night. Take care.